All right, how's everyone doing today? Uh, today I'm going to talk to you about enlightenment or alignment. Um, it's so very important to really crack down words um, and their hidden meanings. Um, just like the little mini video I made about uh, the word religion, um, which you can get real eye, God eye on. Um, so the same thing with enlightenment um, is a key word for alignment. Uh, it's so very important to align yourself um, within yourself and outside self. Um, you really need to learn to balance both, um, which is the light concept and dark concept, which I'll talk about um, in the next video. Uh, but alignment um, is very important uh, because just the very, the way you carry yourself um, can tell a lot about yourself. And um, it's so very important for that. So I'm just going to make it just real quick. So um, it's very important to keep your body straight. And the energy f will flow through your whole body correctly. And the energy will release from your body correctly. You know, it's just like a kink toes, you know. Water's not going to flow through if there's a kink um, in the hose. But if you get that kink out of the hose, um, the water is going to flow through um, all the way. And that's the way it is with your body, with your synergy. Just like a tree, you know, energy will flow through your feet and then will flow out through your head. You know, that's where you look into, into uh, energy currents through your body um, um, or the chakras, you know, things of that nature. Um, it will flow through you in a correct current but if you have any kinks you know like you know you'll see a lot of people will slouch um, or even look down um, this is where the whole process of people being distracted by their phones um, is taking place because people are kneeling down looking at their phones so their current um, is being blocked um, this is where this guy comes in into, into play so energy cannot flow th flow if the current is kinked or blocked. Um, and this is where you can, and there's different forms of this, but um, if you have your head kinked all the time, you're going to end up having headaches, back pain, and even uh, sexual imbalance um, because all that energy is trying to flow and... Um, it's not being able to be released correctly, so you're getting these blockages um, within your body, within your being. Um, so it's very important to just just make sure you're keeping your back straight, and you're just you're pushing your shoulders back and keeping yourself aligned as much as you can. Um, and then this is where a lot of people end up becoming depressed. Uh, you know, it's one of the main things is, you know, because people are constantly slouching and just, you know, are praying, praying to the God of fortune to help them through their situations, you know, um, is just constantly pushing themselves down um, when they really should just be relaxed, you know, and focusing on a meditation state. Um, and, you know, like I've talked about in previous videos, praying is meditation. You know, meditation is, is the ideal um, for everything because it keeps you, keeps you aligned and it keeps you straight. So you can get that full flow that you need. So you're not constantly kinking yourself and uh, not being able to release the energy properly. Um, so that's pretty much it. Um, and like, you know, I show up here is that real eye or realizing, um, and I've been talking about the third eye and bringing it back into play, um, because there's so much, there's just, there's so much controversy with the third eye. Um, so it's, it's really being misunderstood. Uh, so I'm trying to really bring new concepts and ideas into it. Um, because it's just getting blown out of proportion. Everything's getting blown out of proportion. So it's trying to find new ways to simplify, you know, these realizations uh, and not 
not making it so complex or not having you not having you go into all these isms um, you know Buddhism uh, things of that nature you know it's it's just really key things of just realizing uh, that enlightenment is just aligning yourself aligning your spine aligning yourself in a straight stream instead of a bent or curved stream um, that's just going to kink and block uh, the energy within you um, so that's pretty much it so uh, you know leave comments uh, if you got any questions or concerns or new ideas on how we can express the importance of energy that flows through you energy is synergy uh, we have to look past the physical self and bring back more of that spiritual self. Balancing both. Because so many people are dividing the physical self and the spiritual self. A lot of people don't even, even uh, think that there is even a spiritual self. You know, um, you know, I got friends who are atheists, so they don't even look at the spiritual self. Uh, so it's just, it's, it's, it's a mess. It's a mess. So I'm just trying to learn how to keep things simple and just doing these little exercises in your life, um, is going to help balance you and discover new ways of, of thinking and views. Um, exercise definitely is key as well because when you exercise, you know, lifting weights or just, you know, just even doing push-ups and sit-ups, um, align your body. Um, stretching aligns your body uh, and gets some of those kinks out of your body. So there's many different tools um, that only you can discover um, because just sitting down and talking about it doesn't do anything. Uh, so it's up to you to uh, discover all of this for yourself. So that's pretty much it. Um, so like, subscribe, share, um, and create new ideas. Like I said, you know, you making videos can help change the world and change others. So, love yourself. Keep shining bright. Talk to you in a little bit.